probably said a lot of things wrong. I've never used a blowtorch in my life. Uh, and I guess that's the thing, right? I'm, I'm showing you products. I'm showing you projects that I'm working on uh, to show that anyone can do it. Um, just give it a shot. Uh, go out, buy that torch, go take off a bolt and have fun. You know, who doesn't like a torch? Who doesn't like to burn stuff? What's up YouTube? Brandon Hines here with another unboxing video. Uh, today, I have got a treat for you. Um, for all those backyard DIY mechanics, this is the purchase that everyone should get at some time. I have no idea how I made it this far without getting this purchase. Um, you know, especially living in, in Utah, uh, where I had um, salt rust everywhere on, on my vehicle, is I have the TS-8 thousand the ts8000 um, by burns o -Matic is a great great torch um, the on off trigger ability it's adjustable flame control that's kind of the big thing some of the, the cheaper torches out there um, don't have that flame control so you can really fine tune uh, the heat that you're putting out and those size the size of the flame continuous run lock so you're not holding down that trigger still so with the handle here looks like we've got a nice uh, torch tip covering uh, looks like it, it does tighten up, so I'm assuming that as you open it up that it changes some things. Uh, there is an uh, on-off switch here. Very solid. Um, all, all metal except for, for the plastic knob here. Uh, that is plastic. Looks like right is off, so righty-tighty. Lefty-loosey, so left uh, would actually turn uh, the torch on. And again, very solid feel. And uh, I've got a cat. Uh, right here, can't know you can see it, right there. Yep, this is Lulu, everyone. Say hi, Lulu. Lulu, say hi. Hey, now you're all quiet? Okay. All right, I'm doing a video. I picked this up down the street at Home Depot, uh, along with uh, pretty much everything else that I buy uh, for the home and sometimes for the car. It comes with a pretty uh, good-sized bottle uh, here of fluid. Um, and so uh, the Map Pro is, is torch fuel. Uh, there's a yellow bottle, there's also uh, blue bottles, and I uh, just read better reviews here um, on, this, on this yellow, this type of fuel uh, as being a, a better fuel to, uh, to select. So um, I also, here's the thing, you can uh, stick the, uh, the torch right onto uh, this canister, and that's great, right? You can, you can hold it and, and uh, you know, put it where you need it. But when you get in those awkward positions, uh, the car's not that high off the ground and you need to get in there. Specifically, I'm going to, I'll show you uh, on my uh, Volvo S80, I need to do the tie rods and they are so stuck. And uh, the only thing that's gonna get them undone is um, maybe some more PB blaster, but probably uh, what's gonna have to happen is I'm gonna have to get the torch out and to get underneath there and uh, really kind of maneuver around and get it uh, so I could uh, get those tie rod ends off it would be pretty difficult. So um, what I ended up picking up as well, I got my little assistant here. What's up? Looks like I'm gonna have to call on my trusty Opinel knife here, unlock it. When you're doing this and opening it with a knife, uh, it's probably best try not to uh, to cut the tube here. Try not to cut the hose. And so I'm I'm trying to be careful here. I don't know. Maybe scissors would have been a a better better avenue uh, than the knife. But I've got it open now, and uh, now it's just brute force. All right, we've got my hose out, and uh, this is the uh, universal torch extension hose. Uh, for the burns o -Matic specifically, and it uh, looks like this would work for the blue bottles. It would use for the, the yellow bottles as well, and I could actually, I believe with this, uh, the TS-8000, I believe that I can uh, use a blue bottle as well in the future, so I can choose uh, whatever fuel I want. And let's see if I can uh, get this off without, like I said, uh, cutting. The, the end with the tip here. And you can see that that end goes onto the bottle so that would go over here and then this end over here uh, screws right into uh, our handle and uh, this is great because 
like I mentioned, maneuverability is key uh, with this torch. Um, the other thing that I read is uh, with this torch kind of going upside down, so holding it like this to get into those tight spots, um, it's not going to burn as well. And so uh, with this hose, what I can do is I can leave my canister upright uh, over here connected. I can turn it on and then with this I can get to wherever I need to. And I believe uh, that this actually fits around uh, the top and uh, with this attached to it and screwed on, I can hang this somewhere. So I can hang it on a, on a chair, on a dolly, I can hang it on a piece of the car and it will uh, it'll hold there and then I can maneuver my torch to wherever I need to. Tune in next time for uh, when I give this Burnzomatic TS8000 a go and use this extension on the, the Volvo S80 tie rod ends. Awesome. If you haven't already, uh, please subscribe below. It means a lot. Uh, leave a comment. Um, anyway, this will save you lots of time. It will save you lots of money on your PB blaster. And uh, go out, buy the Burnzomatic TS8000.